Mark is writing lines on a chalkboard that is initially blank. And it usually takes Mark 20 minutes to cover an entire board when he's working by himself. Unfortunately for Mark, however, today he is not alone. Today he is with Adam. Now Adam is a troublemaker because while Mark is writing on the chalkboard, Adam is erasing the board at the same time. And it usually takes Adam 50 minutes to erase an entire board by himself. So if these two are working together at the same time with Mark writing and Adam erasing, then how long will it be until the whole board is covered? Now, if you saw the problem involving two pipes and a pool, the approach is going to be the exact same. So first, we're going to consider how much of the board gets covered in one minute. So let's start with Mark. If Mark can cover an entire board in 20 minutes, then that means each minute Mark is covering 1 20th of the board. Similarly, if Adam takes 50 minutes to erase an entire board, then that means each minute Adam is erasing 1 50th of the board. So during each minute, we see that 1 20th of the board is getting covered, but 1 50th of the board is getting erased. And since Adam is literally taking away Mark's progress, we see that during each minute, three one hundredths of the board is being covered. So if we now let T be the total amount of time that it takes for the entire board to be covered, we can set up an equation. So we would have three over 100 times T equals 1. You can view this as one entire board being covered, but more precisely, this is actually representing 100% of the work being done. So if we want to find out how long it would take Mark and Adam to cover 23% of the board, we would set this equal to 0.23. If we want to find out how long Mark and Adam would take to cover 75% of the board, we would set it equal to 0.75. 68% of the board, we set it equal to 0 0.68. But since we want an entire board to be covered, we set this equal to 1. So we see that solving for t is not the hard part. The hard part is actually setting this equation up. Now from here, we can find t easily. We see that t equals 100 over 3, which also simplifies to 33 and 1 thirds minutes. And we can do a final check to make sure that this answer makes sense. So we know that Mark can cover an entire board by himself in 20 minutes. So when Adam is erasing, then it should take Mark longer to cover an entire board. So we can feel pretty confident that this answer of 33 and 1 minutes is correct.